feel like we can pull it off. I mean, it's, a, it's a new character that no one's ever seen. And it was so much fun to do. And it, it was just mind-blowing when I put the makeup on for the first time. Because I looked insane. I, I mean, and Oz, obviously Jackson acts even crazier than he did the first season. <laughs> um, and he's going to continue to just be such an asshole. <laughs> But yeah, so this is incredible. It's definitely going to change, especially with the movie. It's such a heartbreaking world that Jackson has had to go on because he, you know, I've known people who have, uh, Jackson's adopted in the show, and I have friends who are adopted, and they always have this feeling like they're trying to impress the father of the mother. And that's Jackson's thing, you know, he's starting to get really emotional because he, he doesn't have a sense of identity. Now, you know, throwing some supernatural aspects. Now he's a lizard or a turtle or whatever it is. A cannibal. Yeah, a reptile <laughs> world. Uh, so I definitely feel it's a kick in, kick in the things. But um, we'll definitely, Jackson's going to get even more emotional. It was so much fun to play this. It was fun that, that Jeff Davis, our creator, allowed uh, me and Jackson, who is a stereotypical job, to actually have a character as opposed to just be the subsidiary person that, you know, yells at someone and throws them it's funny because there's no repercussions. Yeah, people are getting killed and the library's getting wrecked, <laughs> like demolished, and everyone's like, there was a fight in the library. <laughs> there were fights in libraries that <laughs> broke the whole building and things busted and blew up at all. But uh, yeah, so I mean, it's, it's fun. I was really, really excited um, to get to kind of go kind of go with it. I think it's just revenge on me from Jeff Davis, our creator, saying, it's funny, he's always. He'll give me a compliment and then he'll turn it into like not a compliment. So I'm like, okay, thanks. Okay, so. And he's like, so this this week we're gonna have a CGI snake coming out of your mouth and eyes, but we're gonna take ten hours to shoot it. So I'm like I'm almost throwing up because I'm choking, doing all this stuff, and there's not. It's I look like an idiot because I'm you know there's no snake bite, there's no claw. But uh, I think it's fun because you know it's it's good to have everyone on set and be like jealous of Jackson's character because I get to do all the cool stuff. And I kind of do. I get to do all the really cool stuff. So. It'd be, it's interesting to see what they're going to... What... I mean, you know what they're going to do. It's interesting to see what they might do with... It, keeping Jackson in some sort of supernatural form if they can. And, or if there's a way... If there's a possible cure, if there's a way to make Jackson human, or if anyone would want him to be human, because Jackson set out on this quest to really be the best, and I think that Jackson would, would want to remain the best, and will will and could possibly use his supernatural powers in the long run.